Hey you guys, this is Blast453 here, and I'm sorry I haven't made a video in a while. I was just like thinking of a video to make, and this seemed like one that some people want to do, or something like that. They would like need it. Anyways, this video is about um um let's say uh the Apple ID. As you can see, the Apple ID can help you go sign in into iTunes and sync in your iPod, your iPad 2 that just came out at March 11, but it is March 19, so it's kind of a while ago, like nine days. Um, well, I'm sorry, 10. Anyways, um, you guys, this this helps you sync in. So if you it just helps you, so just let me just all you simply have to do is just type in Apple ID right there, and then it tells you it. And once you load it all up, and it says what's an Apple ID. You can use an Apple ID for everything you do with Apple. Shop with the iTunes store and sh log into iChat or MobileMe. Buy from the Apple online store. Make re reservations at an Apple retail store and access Apple.com support. See, so this what will the Apple ID work with. Work with iTunes, iChat, ooh, MobileMe, Apple online store, and an Apple retail store and Apple.com support. As you can see, this is just the basic ways you can do it. Just all you gotta do is just simply click on create an Apple ID. And right here, they give you the the place where you make it. First, what you're gonna have to do is type in an Apple ID. Choose an Apple ID and password. Enter your primary email address as your ID, Apple ID. So first, you're supposed to type in your email address, as they have an example right there. And then create your own password and then confirm it again and then they have a security question like this if you forget your password you can just have this name of your hometown and then answer it so then you'll have it and then you just pick your birth date then if you want to you can put in your first middle and last name but as you can see it's just optional right there it, yeah and then it says enter your primary address. Please enter your mailing address. That's only if you want to um buy an Apple item. Like if you bought something from the internet from the Apple store online, then that's the only reason why they would want your address. So Apple is pretty secure. They won't get you um they're not supposed to give you a virus or anything like that. And they're not supposed to let they're not trying to um like, you know, try to know where you live and then try sending you bills and all that. It's just uh it's it's just to tell you like if you were to buy something and it's pretty safe. And see as you can see there is a lock up there telling you that if you put in your any information nobody will know except for Apple. Like company and there you select your country region, company institute, address, town city, state providence, and zip code and then preferred language. As you can see, I picked English because I'm in America right now. And you can pick either from email or just mail or whatever. Newsletters on iTunes, they just give you that. Then you have to type in some code. And then you have to agree to the terms of service of Apple Customer Care Service. Pri privacy policy, sorry. And Apple Terms of Service. And then next, all you got to do is click Create an Apple ID. But since I didn't enter any of these, I'm going to have to fix all this junk. But since I already have an Apple ID, so I don't need to do this. But for those who need to, that's all you need to do. And after that, you should have an Apple ID. You might need to go to your email account and then check if you have gotten your email, if you have gotten your Apple ID. And then, bam, you should have the your own Apple ID. iPad 2, thinner, lighter, faster, FaceTime. Smart covers 10 other batteries. Yeah. Oh yeah, guys. I'm sorry. I I, I said I was gonna get the iPad 2, but I changed my mind. And I'm 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 thinking about getting the iPad 3 because the iPad 2 is not much of an upgrade for me, c even though I haven't never had one yet. But I'm thinking about getting the iPad 3 because the iPad 3 seems more better. Okay. Um. I'll see you guys in my next video. Just don't forget to hit subscribe and um rate this video and thumbs up i want to hit like at least 50 likes guys that that's um i'm trying to get up there for likes and just see you guys in my next video peace